हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट अनदर सर्विस दैट आई हैव एडेड इनसाइड माय फ्री मीडिया टूल्स डॉट कॉम वेबसाइट व्हिच इज कॉल्ड एज टेक्स्ट टू स्पीच सो इफ यू गो टू दिस लिंक फ्री मीडिया टूल्स डॉट कॉम स्लैश टेक्स्ट टू स्पीच दिस इज अ सर्विस आई हैव मेड हियर टुडे आई हैव आल्सो गिवन द लिंक इन द वीडियो डिस्क्रिप्शन यू कैन गो टू दिस लिंक and here this is a very simple service which is which will convert your text to speech a human voice so here i can just type any word hello world this is my name gautam and here the second option it gives you a drop down here you can select various languages such as chinese catalan armenian arabic albanian danish let me just select dutch voice here and then you have the option to download the audio file which will be a mp3 file which will speak these words so if i click this you will see a mp3 file will be downloaded if i play this file you will see this lady will speak these words hello world this is my name gautam so you will see this is precisely what we are talking about a mp3 file which is text to speech very good service you should use this service in your day to day life if you want to the link is there inside the video description you can change the language accordingly you can change it to let's suppose french the accent will change if i now play this in french you will see hello world this is my name gotham so you can see the accent has been changed in various languages according accordingly what you can select let me select chinese you will see if i again download it so just wait now you can see it is downloading so if i play hello world this is my name gotan so you can see let me take one other example let me choose arabic and then if i click download audio file so you hello world this is my So in this way guys you can develop this service and uh, in this video I will show you step by step that how I developed this service from scratch using Node.js and Express so I am running this website on a virtual private server VPS so you should be having VPS server according in inside your hosting plan so you should be having VPS and uh, for the node package manager I am using this dependency if you go to npmjs.com I am using this package called as G double T S. This is a library that I am using. G double T S. The first link which comes in, click click on this link, and this is a free text to speech library in Node.js. You can see it has got one to one one two weekly downloads, and there is a simple example which is given, and various languages are supported. You can see supported in languages. All these languages are supported. you can see and now to make this service uh, let me just show you how to make this let me just open my let me go to my desktop inside projects i have my website free media tools let me open this inside command prompt so the very first thing you will do you will install three dependencies you can go to the video description to download all the source code as well I have also given the link to the source code. So first of all, you will initialize your Node.js project and install Express. Malter, Malter will be file uploading library. And thirdly, you will install G double T S. So install these three dependencies. And let, let me just run my server. npm run dev start. So it will start my server. So you will see now to create. inside this services i will add one other service here let me just copy this service this is just a html code i have written i have given this code inside video description so i am just using some bootstrap so here i will change the name of service to text to speech demo and uh, this will be text to speech demo so here after making this change we need to make this file here 
text to speech demo dot ejs this is ejs as you all know it is a template engine so the file is created now we simply need to go to index.js and whenever we make a get request to this we just need to create we need to load this file so inside this uh, here we can make a simple get request app dot get so text to speech demo and request response and we can just render out this template which we have created text to speech demo and also we can give it a simple title let me just close it so this will be text to speech demo free media tools so if i load this uh, if i load my project on localhost 5000 you will see uh, my service will be listed listed here you can see text to speech demo if i click convert now it will open this template currently it is empty now we need to simply go to this text to speech and we need to write a simple template here so for templating we are using some bootstrap so you can just change the title text to speech uh, demo and inside this we will have the bootstrap container class inside this we will have the h1 heading and we will attach a bootstrap class of text center so this will be text to speech demo and inside this after this we will have a simple form the action will go to text to speech demo and this time the method will be post and inside this guys we will have a simple text area so we will bind this inside form group this is the bootstrap bootstrap class and we will have a text area where we can write some text so we will give the name attribute to it so name will be simply text and we will also give a simple label that text colon and now if i refresh it you will see there will be a text area the styling is not good we need to attach a form control class here or bootstrap form control so you will see it will style itself if i refresh it you will see this is our text area here we can write anything it is resizable you can even resize it by clicking this right you can see that and after this we simply need a select box where we will have various languages you can see in order to have all these languages i will just copy paste the code here i have also given inside the video description you can check it this is a code here this is a lengthy code select box it will include all the languages you can see english chinese all that stuff so if i write this inside this video this video will become almost 1 hour so i simply can copy this code instead of writing it so let me just copy it whole here this needs to be wrapped inside our div so let me go to text to speech demo and simply what we can do paste it and if i refresh here you will see all these languages will be there inside this uh, select box select language of choice after this we will have a simple button we will again bind this inside form group and what we will say is that we will say a uh, button btn btn danger btn block and this will be convert or we can simply say download audio file that's it so if i refresh it you will see also a button full uh, full width 
of red color download audio file. So now the interface is complete. Now we just need to hook up the functionality. So we can just go to our index.js file here. So what you can do is that you can import the library that you have installed. So I have already imported this GTTS. You can see require GTTS. Now what we want we want to get the text so we can just make a simple post request here so here I can say app.post the route was text to speech demo and this is request response and here we will check we will first of all get the text that the user has entered so inside text variable so we will have request or body dot text after this we will also get the language language will be simply request dot body dot language so i am just getting it inside the name attribute that i have declared here so each you can see i have given this name attribute of language and text so here i am just getting these values so after this we just need to call the library g double t s uh, i think if you go to the documentation they have given a complete example on how to do this so you need to create const a new variable here voice new g double t s and here you need to pass first of all the text so we will simply pass the text and the language that's it so now it it returns a promise in order to, this is the first example i am giving you in order to save this we have the save method dot save so here you can just give a output file name i can construct this output file path here like this i have declared this variable at the top output file path so this will be unique so we are using date dot now and then we can concatenate output dot mp3 so we can just pass this name here inside this save method output file path and also this returns a callback function if you see it returns the result and the callback function it returns error or result so we need to first of all check if any sort of error takes place in that scenario we need to uh, remove our uh, output file so output file part we are removing it and also we can send out a message that unable to convert to audio simply if no error take place then we can download this file response.download this is the express method we can download the output file by providing the path this also returns a callback if any sort of error take place we can remove our output file path and for the error we can send out an error that unable to download the file and if it is successfully downloaded in that case also we are we need to remove this output file from the server so we can just pass output file path that's it so this is the application guides very few lines of code i have developed an online application if you see if i type anything here let's suppose uh, hello world my name is Gotham. If I choose the language, if I Croatian, click download, you will see cannot post text to speech demo. What is the problem? I think I have made a mistake. Text to speech demo. So inside this post request, oh i think inside this post oh sorry we are <laughs> made a mistake here text to speech that was the mistake if i correct this if i once again write hello world 
my name is Gautam. You can have any number of text. There is no limit that you can even just write one line. You can just write it. You can just copy paste a bunch of text. And let me just select the language French. If I click download audio file, uh, gtts dot save is not a function. Uh, what is the problem? Let me just see g double t. Oh, sorry. This needs to be voice. Because we have instantiating a new instance of GTTS, so that that is this needs to be voice. Uh, hello world, this is Gautam here. If I click the language Greek, click download audio file, you will see the audio file is downloaded. If I play it, the audio file. Hello world, this is Gautam here. You can see that if I change the language, let's suppose Arabic, click download, you will see. Hello, world. this is good. So, in this way, guys, you can develop this awesome, awesome service in Node.js and Express, and you can just deploy it onto your online converter website. Same as I am, I have just did. You can see. All the links is there inside the video description. Live demo link is also get there. All the source code is also there inside the video description. So please make sure that to check out the video description. Please hit the like button, subscribe the channel and I will be seeing you in the next tutorial.